Hi guys, in this example we're going to be looking at a flow with changing density using the conservation of mass law. So here's our example, a 200 litre drum is initially filled with brine which is a salty fluid. We've been given the density of uh, 1030 kilograms per meter cubed. Fresh water is flowing steadily into the drum at 5 litres per second. We've also be been given that density uh, which causes the drum to overfill and spill over the rim. We've been asked to find the density of the mixture as it changes with time. So here's our situation. We've got an inflow of fresh water and there's brine initially in the, the drum, the 200 litre drum. And as the fresh water overfills the drum, it spills over the side. So despite dealing with a steady flow here, the fluid inside the drum will have a density that changes with time. So we can't cancel out the first term in our mass conservation equation. We're going to be using that in this calculation. We need to define our control volume first, uh, which will be the drum, as well as the bit flowing from the tap here. So this tiny little bit here. Um, I've included that for purely academic reasons, but practically we're looking at the inflow and outflow of the drum. Um, so that's only to distinguish the two surfaces. Surface one is the top is the surface of the inflow, the the bit of water coming in from the tap here, the fresh water, and the second surface is going to be the surface of the drum. So in this example, the surfaces won't matter so much, uh, which we'll see as we go on, because we're going to be dealing with fluid flows and not uh, velocities. So bef before we carry out the equation, we need to define our densities. Since we're dealing with multiple here, we've got the, the density of the fresh water and the density of the brine. So the density of the fresh water, I'm going to denote as rho f. So rho f will be my brine. Sorry, doesn't make sense. That will be my fresh water. And the density of the fluid in the drum, which is a constantly changing density. So this is a constant density equal to 1,000 kilograms per meter cubed. Rho d will be the density of the water in the